president of the Federal Capital Development Authority, staff multi-purpose cooperative society, has promised to surpass his achievements in the last tenure through, the, through more aggressive pursuit of investment opportunities. Ajiboye Oyebanje Tundi, who is the president of the cooperative society, gave the assurance during an acceptance speech when the electoral committee presented certificates of return to the newly elected executive committee members of the cooperative society. Here is a report. The representative of the Director of Cooperatives in the FCTA, Mr. Shalako Olushe Guntaurid, Deputy Director Cooperative, FCTA, admonished the ex-co members to promote unity among themselves. Please, I'm encouraging all of you. Please, let's, put all, let's all hand be on there. And let us see how we can move this cooperative forward. There are also foreign intervention forms. But where there are disunity, we cannot bring such ones into your area. Into, into the system. Chairman of the Electoral Committee, Mr. Mati Lukuro Koredi, equally called on the leadership of the cooperative to ensure they remain united as he called on members to pray for their guidance. All of you have decided to bury your hatchet. All of you have seen the need to now work together. And I tell you that if you stick to that promise, if you have achieved 1,000 before, I look forward to you achieving 10, in, in his brief acceptance speech, Ajiboye Oyebanji Tunde, president of the FCDA staff multipurpose cooperative society, thanked members and promised to uphold their trust to take the cooperative to higher heights. To God, there is nothing that is impossible. I'm hoping and praying that by the special grace of God, within these two years that has been given to us, that we together, together this. We will, see what we, can, we will see what we can do in God's name. Mm -hmm. I also want to assure you that um, any form of rift within us has been buried. Amen. Amen. The new ex members are to serve for two years beginning from 26th of August 2024. Usman Khatun Umar, Aso Television News.